Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Oak and Lamb YouTube channel. My name is Rachel Langston. I'm going to be acting a fool today, and I'm an owner and craft educator <laughs> at Oak and Lamb. <laughs> and the voice that you're going to hear giggling at me this entire hour is Becca Oaks, and she's also an owner and craft educator here. And today, we're just trying to make you laugh. Much. I may or may not have begged Rach to drunk burp in the middle of this, if she could. <laughs> Am I drunk? No. No, however, not even a little bit. However, I have my water here, and if, if any burps come up, I'll just let them fly, <laughs> you know? Um, so let's talk about how we're drunk um, crafting today. So, if on, like Becca said in an uh, Instagram story, if only we could just have brought in some Chardonnay or something like that yeah. and just slowly got to the point where we felt giddy enough to craft like this. But it, alas, it is only 1030 in the morning here. So we purchased some kaleidoscope rave glasses from Amazon. Yes, because drunk glasses are a thing. Drunk goggles are a thing. Police academies use them for testing things like they are completely real however they're like two hundred dollars yeah. and they don't do a ton of things differently than these kaleidoscope glasses they are used to impair your vision and kind of twist some things around in your sight of vision to make it to make you impaired to make it harder for you to do things and not only are we using kaleidoscope glasses but i have actually flipped one of the lenses around <laughs> Which has made it twice as bad. If she gets through this without puking, just from vision issues, I'll be shocked. It's like when I put them on, my eyes want to go cross-eyed because yeah. I can't see right. So we might take some breaks in between so I can see how bad I'm doing and things like that to get my eyes readjusted. Yeah. But it's going to be really funny. So, so I hope you guys are ready. What all are you crafting today? Thank you, Becca, for yes. asking. I'm excited to tell you. I'm going to be, in no particular order, trying to paint a crate several different colors. I want to be able to paint it. Oh, so are you going to do like the slats different colors? I want to try and do the <laughs> slats different. Yes, Becca, exactly. Okay. I want to try and do the slats different colors on this little baby crate. Um, I'm also going to be weeding some vinyl that we've cut and applying transfer tape to it and placing it on this glass jar. Um, I'm also going to be placing some miscellaneous cut letters that's supposed to make up a cute cut file that says coffee onto a card base here with a zig glue pen and some reverse tweezers. My prediction, although I have had these goggles on, so I know how impaired it makes it, but my prediction is that you still do a decent job. That's nice of you to say. Yeah. I was practicing, not practicing, I wasn't like doing, crafting with yes. them on, but I put them on before the live and I was messing around with our uh, tools here. I couldn't even get the tools even close to where they were. Since one of them's flipped, it's like it's sending me several inches the other direction. So I think <laughs> I'm putting it in its slot and I was like back here where the paper towels were. <laughs> I had to take my goggles off and be like, where the crap is this thing supposed to go? Is it like trying to grab something behind you when you're looking in the yes, mirror or something? Yes, you're just like, yeah. Yes. Which it's very is difficult. This? Yeah. It's very difficult. So I have these linked down below. They were only $16. $16 compared to like $200 and something. I was like, sign me up. This is going to be great. Yes. And if you love this, we might buy more of these and do like a competition yeah. during an event that we're having soon or something like that. So definitely stay tuned. Also, um, if you're brand new here, first welcome to this hilarious show yes. here. Very well. um, we love to make you guys laugh. We love to entertain you, but our goal here at Oak and Lamb is to educate you, not only on cricket, but we do teach and train on a multitude of different crafty um, things. We have a glow forge, we have a sublimation printer, we love to woodwork, we love to sew. We do a lot here, we would love to walk hand in hand with you and make you a better crafter every day. Whether you're a beginner or an advanced crafter, we can meet you where you're at and make sure that you're always leveling up. That's what we're here to do. If and you're we also interested- also wanna be your friend if you need a crafty friend. We do wanna be your friend, yeah. Becca, we do. And if you're interested, click the link down below. Becca's popping some links in the chat. You can get your first month with us for only $9.99. I wanna get that out of the way because if I'm drunk enough, you I might not even remember to say not that. Remember, yeah. So, 
become a flock member here. We would love to see you. We would love to. They do want a competition, yes. You want a competition? They, um, Stacy specifically asked for you and Anna to go head to head. Me and Anna? You and Anna head to head. There. Why me and Anna specifically? I don't be, well, probably because I we're, don't know. we're a little bit mean probably to Probably because other. she thought that I would be too good even with the goggles. <laughs> Seriously? Okay, no, I just realized also, I can't even come close to, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I'm going to have to tell you. Wait, let me find, I bet I can like find one of these lenses here. Hang to on. look through. You all oh, can't oh, tell me is. she's like looking at the corner of the table right now. There it is. Friends don't let friends craft drunk. Jan, that's right. See, I can still read comments a little yeah. bit. I have to close my right eye though. <laughs> okay. Well, okay. Tell me what particular order do you want me? Oh my gosh. Do you want me to paint first, to do the vinyl first, or do you want me to put the um, pieces of paper on the card first? I don't know, but you don't have a poster board in your painting. I do. It's behind me. Do you? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Um, let's do, I want you to do the card first. So gluing okay. the, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Hang on. I didn't think through this. So Did you pull the to... adhesive out already? Do you know where it is? Are you using the ATG gun or the Zig pen? The Zig pen. It's oh, I think here. you should use both. Serious? Okay, hang on. Is that the little one or the big one? That's the... <laughs> it's good. That's good. Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Sure. Do you need some reverse tweezers? No. Yes. <laughs> I want this one. The big one? Yeah. Okay. I'll put that in there later. <laughs> I went to one of those wine and paint parties after two bottles of wine and me. My picture got a little blurry. I'll have to post a picture in the group. Dana, two bottles of wine and I would be conked out asleep. Wine makes me so sleepy. That is hysterical. I would love to see your end shoot. project. Okay, I got it. Shoot. Okay, okay. Got it. Go. Got it. Okay. Okay. Hang on. Okay, okay. Which camera are we on? We're you. on me still. You. Okay, let me yeah. clear this off. Hang on. Gosh, this is way harder than I thought it would be so far. Okay, I'm doing the card first. Yes. <laughs> it's like you're it's like you're crafting in the dark, which also would be a fun craft. <gasps> Oh, we could get like a like a black, not like a black. You could just light, put like but... cardstock in those and black them out. I really want to read comments. I'll read them to you. Come on. I don't trust you to read them to me. Move the cup. Which cup? Oh, I mean, my cup. Are... Oh, yeah. so that you don't knock it over. Megan said this is so hard to watch, laugh, and try to work. <laughs> did Rachel okay. just swear? No, she didn't, but it did sound like she was going to. Oh boy, I should have, but did I? No, not? it sounded like you were going to. Okay. Okay. I'll be that, surprised if something doesn't fall off the table at some point. Debbie, me too. I know, I'm kind oh of Oh gosh, that. there's an added issue. What? I'm making them sweaty. I'm, <laughs> they're clouding up. <laughs> Becky, no, they're, Becky, they're clouding here, up. Here, I'll make it cooler in here. I'm going to no, turn the okay. air down. No, it's okay, it's okay. You, I mean, it's, it's okay. like 67. Do you want it down? It's okay. Okay, so are we overhead now? No, uh, we are now, yeah. <laughs> Hang on. So what's your method? Are you going to put the... Border on first. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I would do. That's, that's going to be... It's going to be good. I feel like this is the center. That's centered. Okay, hang on. How did you do that? Oh, that's, you're going to rip it. <laughs> I can't see. Wait, <laughs> way, hang on. We're just going <laughs> to. Hey, you didn't prime it. Did you prime it? We're on the table? <laughs> I thought I was. Hang on.
Okay. April Rhodes says this is the best birthday morning. Funny. Happy birthday, Happy April. Happy birthday. <clears throat> what plans do you have for your birthday? Let us know. Uh, Megan says they are so much cuter than the ones we had to use in high school. Did you have to? Oh, hold on. I have to go back. Did you have to use drunk goggles in high school, Megan? Oh, my goodness. 67, that's freezing. Actually, Julie, I am I'm a little bit hot right now. Um, I'm wearing a sweater, but Crap. it's not really thick. I don't know which side the adhesive's on. Mm. Vonda says, hi, I'm new to your channel and I'm enjoying this so much. Vonda, do not judge us by this video. Um, but we're so glad that you're here with us and that you have decided to spend your morning with us. Right, should you put adhesive on both sides of that? I didn't <laughs> intend to do that. Okay. Can you even tell which letter is which? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's like I can see what's in front of me, but my hand isn't moving where I want it to move because the, per the depth yes. perception is off. Yeah, okay. Okay. Oh my gosh, Megan said yes, and they set up a course for us to drive through the golf cart while wearing them. I would love to do that. I'm over here trying not to laugh too loud because my fiance is laying on me sleepy. <laughs> Kathy, that's so funny. Julie says she's stressing about the table. Right, right. It's okay. It's just a little glue. It should just roll right off. Oh, that is. Which way is the glue on here? Well, it is glued to your finger. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe just use your finger. Your no. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's nice. It's not straight. Okay, that's good. You know what we could do is drunk goggle against Fallon crafting and see which. Like Fallon doesn't have to wear the drunk goggles, but we'll see which is better. <clears throat> Oh my goodness, I'm mildly concerned that the neighbors are going to hear me laughing so hard is what Crystal Ann said. Oh my gosh. Um, Does, is this even sticky? Griselle says, this is me crafting without glasses. <laughs> <laughs> That's an A. Susan thinks it would be easier if you just did it without, like, with closing your eyes. Honestly, it probably, oh, I'm not kidding. It probably wouldn't. Close I'm your eyes sweating. and just see. Close your eyes and see. Like if you could feel it out. Okay. Because honestly, when I did that one with Anna where I was her hands, I was, that's crafting blind. It wasn't, it didn't look great, but it wasn't terrible. Oh. <laughs> Maybe open your eyes. <laughs> I'm going to open my eyes again. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, well, there we go. Penny says that looks like her trying to use uh, reverse tweezers always. Y'all, I love you all. Oh, oh. Just Did saying, I lose a letter? I think, well, no. It's there. Sweaty hands. There we go. <laughs> Found it. No way worry. <clears throat> And he says, hi, everyone. How fun. I thought gluing after midnight was a real challenge. I've not tried to craft drunk. I also have not tried craft drunk, drunk crafting. I don't know if I would recommend it. We'll be cleaning glue off that table for months. Yes, we will. And also, there's a big scrape on it from the, was it the, uh, the uh, Cricut or press. the HTV? I'm mountain? pretty sure it was the auto press. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> I wonder if you really are drunk and if you use the glasses, if it has the opposite effect. Diana, that's a thought. I don't know. I don't, I don't, I think it would just. Crap. Oh. Yeah, crap. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, this is hard. It's like you think you get the hang of it, so then you get like cocky. Cocky, and then you're yeah. Like, yeah. Hey, I'm surprised, honestly, that you can even see the letters. <laughs> Why do they keep sticking to your fingers? <laughs> <clears throat> okay, that's good. That's good. Mm. <laughs> what? Rach, you said sweaty hands like you were activating it as a superpower. <laughs> <Activate>. <laughs> 
How did we think of this idea, Rach? Um, I was watching a Try Guys YouTube video from BuzzFeed. If you know them, give us a shout out. That's not even close. Hang on. Um, I love the Try Guys from BuzzFeed. And they were legit. They were trying to like cook drunk or something like that. And I'm they were like, legitimately drunk. They were legitimately drunk. Yeah. Like there were, there were, um, it, it was like supervised <laughs> by medical staff and things like that. Yeah. But, okay, screw that. They're, uh, they were like crafting drunk and it was hysterical. Yeah. And I thought we could do that, I bet, but not, you know. Uh, drunk Megan drunk. said that she made a glitter tumbler one night while she was pretty tipsy. That night she thought it was the best that she'd ever made. And then the next day it looked like a six year old had done it. Yeah. <laughs> How's it going, right? You finished one. Oh, you go. Got it. Okay. Got it. Yeah, this is the funny part. Let me just. <laughs> you just stab yourself on that quilling on. tool. Oh, oh. <laughs> See if I like feel for it. But if I don't, and I'm trying to legit put it in the right spot, I would pick here. Oh, ah! no, that's, oh, you did get I it. I did. Yeah. Okay, sweet. Okay, we got one done. Yeah. Oh, I gotta put these up. It could have been worse. I mean, the table wouldn't have fared too much. No. Or poorly, but. Um, okay, what do, do you want me to do next? Do the paint one next. Mm -hmm. How does this, I don't, it's not, I mean, it's not great. It does look like a child made it, but it's all put together. That's not that bad. It, it could be a lot worse. There's glue all over it. Look at the table, Rachel. <laughs> I was, it looks like I was really confident too. Yeah, well. I like just stab, drag, yeah. it wasn't close. Well, I got this and then you were at least four inches off. <laughs> it wasn't even close, that was the funny thing. Are you trying to decide if that's white or if it's yucky on the other side? I picked it out before the live. Okay. Crystal said, watching Rach drunk craft is better than I can craft while sober. <laughs> Stop it. <clears throat> oh gosh, yeah. <laughs> oh, we're doing four colors. Rach, there's only three slats. Are you going to do the sod something? Which one? Wait, no. I need to. Okay. Also, I Get have to. Get rid of the white one. Get rid of the white one. It's the one furthest away from you. Who gets to clean the table? Uh, Anna, because she's not here. <laughs> Odd. Do you want one of those thingies to squirt the paint in? No. No. Okay. I'm going to put it right on my brush. <laughs> oh, I'm sure you are. I'm sure you are. <clears throat> Vonda says she makes the best meals while she's drunk. I bet you do. Oh, okay. You want me to if get you? If you all only knew how hard I was concentrating, I'm not kidding. Okay. Do you want me to get you a paint puck full of water or no? No, I'll okay. use different ones. Okay. This is where I'd like to see a dirty poster board to confuse Rachel even more. <clears throat> That's not going on the paintbrush. <laughs> okay, hang on. See, it's, it almost feels like cheating when I feel it out. Have Ana use those glasses to cut hair. Are you volunteering to be her dummy? Oh, oh. See, because oh. if I feel it out, I just follow this thing down. Like, I can yeah. do that. The depth perception is the worst. Oh. Like, I'm not going to feel it out, because that would be... I'm just not even going to feel it out. Okay, by just looking at this... Are you going for the top or the bottom? Which one should I go for? I don't, it doesn't matter. I just was curious. Right here. That's the middle. Oh, I see it. Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> the more pressure you put on it, the better it is. You're gonna dig a hole through it. Is that going on? Uh, I think so. Woo! <clears throat> it's not bad. I would probably flip my, yeah. 
Oh, that's good. I feel good about this. I'm seeing like three of them, by the way. Shirley thinks you've been practicing. <coughs> oh, no. <laughs> wait, wait. Mm. To your left. You, that, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. No. No. So I guess once you get your brush down, it's easy to see. Do you see the lines? Like, what are you seeing? I see one right here. I can't even. So, but like There's one, like several of them. It, so a kaleidoscope has like, it's like a shape. So it has different flat parts. Yeah. If my eyes can focus on a flat part, then I can see what I'm doing. So once you get your brush down but and it, see. Yes. Yeah. The picking fine. up of things like the, the, the brushes, I know where they're, where, where they are, but where my hand wants to go, they're not there. Okay. Yeah. It's tricky. Crap. <clears throat> Like, if I just don't think about it, I just place my brush where I think this is, then I go up there like that. <laughs> the picking up of things is what's difficult. That reminds me when Anna was little. She, well, she, well, actually, she still does it. When you wake her up, if she's been asleep, she's just fallen asleep then she doesn't really have normal thoughts and can't really process things. And so mom and dad, like if she fell asleep downstairs and we were watching TV, they'd tell her to, <clears throat> to get up and go upstairs to her room and she would pick up her pillow and blanket, but they would say, hey, you forgot your pillow. So she like stood in the floor grabbing her pillow. She was already holding it, but went to like try to grab her pillow. And that's what it reminds me of, grabbing at nothing at all. That's what it feels like. Yeah, well, that's because you are grabbing at nothing, but... <clears throat> We're going to try this differently. Am I going on there? Are you squeezing it? Oh, okay. Yeah, see? Is that better? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Back of your life makes it even better. It's my smoker's wheeze. I can't help I can't She's help it. She's not a smoker. I'm not a smoker, yeah. But the problem is, is that when I do that, then I get choked and then I cough and it's a whole thing. I did that mean video to Fallon where you put Nutella or chocolate on your hand and then ask them to bring you toilet paper when you're in the bathroom. Um, and I was laughing so hard. Like my throat hurt the next day from coughing and laughing. It was ridiculous. And she sent it to me mm -hmm. and then I... Was, was good. Was laughing. You created a beautiful green color down there. I'm trying to get in this nook. That's a cream. straight line that, well, I mean, oh. This is intentional. It's like a new ombre. Get that bottom right corner, H. Oh, wait. Hang on. <laughs> there, there we go. Yeah. I got it. I'm trying not to feel it out with my other hand. Cause that's when it gets that's green <laughs> Shirley says you're doing so well that she's almost afraid you're a closet alcoholic yeah Rachel's that's an open is. book if she were one I think we would all know I just have it in my dress just bring her flask with her to work I would is it a what are those bras that you can like fill with wine or something they have a straw you're not helping me <laughs> You're, uh, I'd go, yeah. I see it. <clears throat> I'm wanting to join, but it's going to have to wait till next month. Will the code still be valid? Vonda. Yeah, it, we will always make sure that you are able to join uh, with a discount. If Even if people are like re-watching and it's been a year from now and you need a discount to join, just email us. Hello at oakenlame.com. We'll help you out. But yes. Um... Right? Oh my gosh. Where was Kat's comment? Hold on. OMG, oh, all I can think of are those people that are turning, tuning in for the first time. You need a disclaimer posted on the screen. Yeah, we, we for sure do. Yeah. <laughs> Although, the title. <laughs> the title, yeah, that's helpful. It's not like we were going to be like crafting for beginners or cricketing for beginners and then you just come on with. Okay, right here where I'm smearing this paint. Yeah. Right here is where that that pink dollop of paint is on my goggles. And then I see another one over here. 
Yeah, there's another one there. But like, this is where I see it, but I know it's not there. These are weird. Okay. Well, you've gotten it. I mean, <clears throat> you've made a glorious color down below. That's pretty. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I could... I could do that. Do you want a paper towel? No. Okay. I love that color. What is the color? Which, Which one? one? <clears throat> um, paint swatch by Rach on the bottom one. And then the middle one and top ones. I got these to, to go with our oak and lamb colors. That's all we use here, you know, is oak and lamb colors. <laughs> if it's not in our color uh, palette, it does not exist. She literally made me take white out. Yeah, well, because you weren't going to really be able to see it. Oh, Rach, it's not an open roll. Shoot. Do you want me to help you? No. Okay. I want to say just so you feel it. Yeah, out. yeah. Hmm. Did you get it? Oh, she's even going to clean. Oh, her hands. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> the pink is called. Hang on. Oh, are you going to read it for us? This is. Hang on. <laughs> Where's the oh there oh oh crushed coral? Is it oh. folk art? Yeah, crushed coral. I have a purse that has a plastic liner that you put wine in, and then there is a spout. A friend gave it to me about four years ago, and I haven't used it yet. Diana, <laughs> crack up yet? Oh, could you imagine going through a security line with that? Oh, wow. You want to put it back in the cup? We'll wash them later. Huh? Those are clean. Those. I just meant like down in it. You know what? You you do you, right? Um... <laughs> <clears throat> mm. uh... Oh, everyone is super excited that Vaughn is going to be joining our oh. group. Um, Debbie loves the nice gradient that you created. Thank totally, you. totally intentional, Debbie. <laughs> um, Amanda says, yay, I'm catching you all live. Welcome, Amanda. We're glad you're here live with us. Well, Amanda, what a live you've caught. So... She says this is the absolute best use of her time. She's so glad she found it. <laughs> Rachel, you were closer to hitting me than that trash can. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Did you, yeah, did you look? I'm full of these up because I'm sweaty. I don't know what you're trying to grab for. My girl. Oh. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> okay, hang on. The goggles were sixteen or seventeen dollars. I don't know. Well, well worth the price. Yes, they're listed below. If you also would like to craft a drunk, Miss Shirley. Here's the thing. Oh! <laughs> I didn't say them. Oh, no. That ATG gets like 60 bucks now. Is he okay? Well, I'll just have to re. Wow. What happened? Nothing. It's fine. Um, people, I asked Rachel, do people actually use these? And she said that people, I mean, she doesn't know by experience, but people like to go to raves. That was in the description on. of them. They go to raves. First of all, a rave is just not my scene. Um, but they go to raves with these on. I, I would imagine they're inebriated or uh, under some influence of something. And then it just... Uh, <laughs> That's just goes coffee. from there. Yeah. Okay. Uh, these are nice and fogged up. Okay, now we have to weed. I 
I am honestly concerned about your well-being of your hands here. Of I, my hands? Yeah. Maybe you need a dull pokey tool. Did you already bray it? I mean, squeegee it? Uh-huh. Okay, good. I have a question about the ATG gun. Is there a difference between the pink and yellow version? I can only find the yellow in here. Um, I would have to look, but the actual, there, Scotch has guns that have different, like they take different widths of tape. So make sure that the yellow one takes the width of tape that you want. I think the width that I like, let me look right here while Rachel's getting connected. Is it a quarter inch, Rachel, that we like? Yes. The quarter inch tape is the one that we like. Yeah. And then they have a tape that it has a, the one that we like is, has a red tape around it. There's one that has a yellow tape. I hate that one. It's not very it says good. It it was for like wood and metal and stuff. I hate it. It's not good. Um, anyway, so quarter inch Double-sided adhesive. I think it also comes in like a half inch and things like that. So just make sure that you're good. I'll wipe down our jar with rubbing alcohol. And uh. I swear I think I do better when I close my eyes. <laughs> uh, Diana says she hopes the jar is plastic. Nope. Uh, yes, the yellow is huge and uses wider tape. Okay. Great input. Um, drunk croquet. I love that. I haven't played sober croquet. <laughs> I haven't played since I was a kid. That's those little hoop things that go in your yard. Yeah, with that weird double sticky thingy. Yeah, or it's like a, like a judge's mallet or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really long. Yeah. yeah. Um, I think I need my true control knife. Oh, thank you, Miss Carol. Yeah, well, that's a really good idea, right? <laughs> What are you looking for? For control knife. You really are going to use it? Yeah. I don't know that that's a good idea. Hang Before on. you cut anything, let me make sure your fingers are out of the way. Okay. Okay. So I have my true control knife. That's clean. Weeding tool. Becca, the pins in the Amazon store are the ones you use for resin, right? What size dowels do I need? Yes, we have used those. Um, I don't actually know what size it is. Our tumbler kit came with dowels automatically. So check out the link for the um, the pin attachments for the tumblers and see if it has it in the description. I know, Megan. I just don't think this is a fantastic idea either. What? Why do you? What do you need to true control? Have a little faith, people. Okay. Don't cut anything until I tell you it's okay. I'm like a professional. Okay. Okay. Oh, you're not. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Can I cut? Yeah, you can. <laughs> it's like, oh dear God. Now I have to look at the other direction. So you like feeling it out is better. Now here's the thing. Feeling it out, but I feel like it's cheating for the fun of the it craft. It is because if you were really inebriated, feeling it out would not even matter because your like your thought process, yeah. your brain is coherent right now, and it would not be. Can I cut? Yeah. Okay, okay. that's good. Do I remember first aid? Yeah, put some castor oil on it. And, hey, I don't know that I would put the lid on it for sure though. Nope, 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 nope. Uh. Okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, Feel it out cheating though. Oh Lord, I had a small panic attack. Okay, That's let's small. remove the excess. I'm going on a camping trip in two weeks. I've got to get these for our family cornhole tournament. Oh my gosh, Tammy. That would be hysterical. They have different colors too. Check out the link. It's really funny. Um, why did you pull off the crap? I can't see. <laughs> pulled off the wrong way. I was like, this looks small left on the mat. And he said, can I open my eyes yet? Yes, the, the blade is, is gone. The, no blood was shed. 
I love the cornhole tournament idea. In fact, I'm going on a camping trip for Labor Day with some friends. We may have to do that too. Okay. Um, this is, like, I can't read your comments. It's so sad to me. I'm reading them for you. Okay, are you ready? If I'm not... Oh, you needed a break? I'm looking at the... Oh, gosh. Uh, <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! <laughs> that would never work if you tried to do it again. There's some little pieces in this, too. <laughs> no. What, what letter is this? The L that has nothing to weed. Oh, oh it's upside down. Yes. Oh, when we go camping, we don't need the glasses. We just drink. That is so funny, Diana. I, I, I have to be careful because... Drinking in any amount just makes me sleepy. And then I just want to sleep the whole time. So I don't drink a lot. If I'm trying to wind down, then I'll grab a glass of wine or something like that. But, Rach, I'm going to be honest. You're doing a whole lot better than I thought you would at this. Now, it's <laughs> there's probably holes all in the... Oh, no, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm concentrating. Don't pull up with your right hand. Annie oh. says you read better than me without, honestly, like she's not doing too terrible. Oh, I shouldn't have spoken so soon. It's okay. Oh, goodness. Where? Don't tell me. Well, your F is really. Oh, I see my finger now. Okay. But the bottom of the F is, I think, stuck to itself. Caught that. I did jinx her. I know, Debbie. I did. Oh, you flattened it back out. I don't... Did you get the middle of that F at the top? Mm -hmm. You didn't. Or you did and it laid it back down. Oh, it's up here. <laughs> these, gl these goggles. Honestly, it's really not that bad. Okay. Guys, the amount of concentration for me is like ridiculous. I think there's also, a little Also, these bit... are scratching the crap out of the middle of my nose. I think there's one in the middle of the L, but you can leave it if you want to. Scratching my nose. Oh, relief. Oh, that looks even better. Is there one in the middle that... Yeah. Diana is your biggest cheerleader, right? She's saying that you are doing great. Diana. Oh. oh. <laughs> you went through the backing with your waiting time. Oh, Lord. <clears throat> okay. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah. I can't wait to see you get the backing of this transfer off. If I can feel stuff out, I'm much better at this. Crystal, I agree. She said the fact that you salvaged that F is just insanity. I honestly hey, thought it was a goner. Wait, I actually have a better idea than this. Oh, the masking, yeah. It's not no, there. I think there was a piece can I forfeit that? Can I forfeit the cutting of this? Sure. Again, I, feeling it out is kind of like being blind, you know? But again, if you were really drunk, there's just simply no way you could do this. Watch this, Becca. I'm unlucky. Ready? I can never get them. I have to put it. It's because you don't have any fingernails. No, it's not. Would you wad up the side of it or you something? You just, you bend it down like you dog ear a page of a book. 
whatever. You're not even close. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> You're not my mom. Oh, hang on. Linda says she feels so bad for you because you're trying so hard and she bet you'll have a headache after you take the goggles off. Right, do you think you're going to have a headache? No. Okay. <gasps> I didn't throw my trash away. No, you did not. Did you? <laughs> hey, you actually got that one in. Good. <clears throat> oh, I'll put that back later. Guys, you tell us what you want to see us do next. Either with drunk goggles or legit blindfolded. Or real crafting even. You let us know. But we're all about the entertainment value here. We do appreciate crafting, obviously, and actually teaching you things. However, we do love to have a good time too. Rach, mm -hmm. are you going to remove the mat from the vinyl or just yank it off? I'm nothing if not a rule follower. That. <laughs> That's true. It's true, Rachel. See? Again, we've also done so much of this that I could probably do it. Yeah, it's, it probably just feels second nature. I'm not even looking. Uh-oh. What? There's a little bit of transfer on the back of one of the letters. Like it didn't come off. The back of the F. On the bottom. Oh. No worries. You got that. You got it. I got this. <clears throat> okay. Wow. Oh. Okay. Now, here's the, now, Rachel, are you going to use your squeegee tool? That's what I'm trying to Okay, find. yeah. <laughs> Let's put this back. You don't put it back when, it, when you don't have glue. Never mind. I will. <laughs> you. I need Gosh, to label. She, I need to label this she's, spot. She's going to. Oh. <laughs> it's fine. I didn't need that. Although, I am glad they told you to move your cup because that would have been your cup. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Oh. Um, it's. What's that thing on the top? What is it? It's like an extra. I'm not even gonna like try to find the flat part to make this perfect. I'm gonna look and see. That right there looks like it's centered. Oh no. Oh no. <clears throat> Roll back, my baby. That looks centered. Find us. She oh. says, this is the best life I've had in a few days. I've been dealing with cancer for three years now, and this is one of my bad days. Oh. Praying for you, Miss Bonda. Also, I glad we could hate that for you. Make you laugh. But yes, we are we are very glad that we can make you laugh. Oh, <laughs> at a point when I'm tired of it. I mean, I don't know where you were trying to place it. The F is sort of not on it, right? But I do kind I of I swear like, this works for a tumbler. It, well, it's too big. Um, I do like that you put it at the bottom, though. And I'm not sure if it was intentional or not. Oh, I see. Yeah. And what's that thing? <laughs> see the top part. It's really not that bad. Where did we get the jar? I th think it was Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby? No, I think it was Hobby Lobby. I think I got two of them at Hobby Lobby. Because I, I used it when I did that, when we got that stupid hat press. Yes. Yeah. Yes. <clears throat> Stacey oh. says, Rach, you are a professional. Okay, hang on. So, while she's destroying the studio, um, we like to use 
canisters like this, especially for seasonal things, because you can use this and put a seasonal um, graphic on it and then remove it because it's just vinyl and put a new graphic on it. So like if we did a video showing you how to do this, we would probably take that off and reuse the canister. Yep. Um, I just took a, where's it at? Oh, I just took a, a decal off of this before yeah. I'm live today. So, but you can do that at home too, is what I'm saying. Oh yes, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. Yes, yes. Um, well, guys, your crate is backward, is what they're telling me. There you go. <laughs> Rach. Yes. On a scale of miserable to not so bad, how would you rate this experience? The amount that I had to focus was <clears throat> more than I thought. Okay. I craft mindlessly all day, but right. once you strip away your depth perception and some colors, because this thing also changes the colors up a little uh, bit. I didn't think about that. Things get a little bit weird. Um, it was, it was fun. It was a fun challenge. Uh, I don't think I did as bad as I thought I was going to do. I'm, I'm impressed, honestly. But, but again, we have to think about what you can I'm take thinking. them off if you want okay, to. No. Oh, Becca, I'm not kidding. Let's get it overhead. Becca, Let's get it overhead. I wish you could. They're wet. <laughs> can you see? I don't know if you can see, but pull them up so that they can see what you were seeing through it. Like, try to pull it up to the camera. Okay, I can't get the step ladder. Pull her all the way. No, I mean just like. Well, the front kind of. I don't know if it's on autofocus or not. I don't think it it's is. It's not. No, it won't do it. But order some and you can play with them. It's Becca, very interesting. <laughs> oh, my God, Rachel. They're wet. Let me take a picture of it. <laughs> I've told people. Oh, my gosh. I get sweaty. No, your eyes get sweaty for sure. So they're wet and then steamy. So then I couldn't see very good. Either way, wow. Cheryl said, I've ordered two pairs. I need my kids to try these and understand the dangers of drinking. Cheryl, that's, I mean, yes. And then make them play cornhole in them or like something funny. Basketball. I don't know. Oh, man. Do you know what would be like hysterical with those goggles on? Sewing. Trying to use a sewing machine. With Except then on. you would like sew over your finger or something. That would be horrible. Yeah. That would be horrible. This... This was fun. I think we need to go up with the challenges. I think we need to go harder. Are you, you going to clean off the sweat out of the glasses? <laughs> yeah. I think we need to go harder with something next time. Like what? This is a fat mess, isn't it? It's honestly, I'm Rachel, I, think. I can almost drink the amount of sweat. <laughs> <laughs> so first it fogged up to where I couldn't see. There's no it. way you could have seen through these. And then, but again, if you pick a side of the shape, then you could see what you were doing. So if I've picked a side and held it there, so I think a craft with lots of moving around yeah. would be the most difficult, honestly. But having two or three people try and do like a speed craft off or something like that, I think would be like the most, the most funny thing ever. Like two people here trying to create the same thing. Um, honestly, I still don't find anything as funny as Becca being Anna's hands while she was crafting for, was it, that was for Christmas, wasn't it, Becca? Uh, yeah. I think so. It was so funny. Uh, One-handed crafting Debbie. Yes. Yes. Um, everyone's going to get these. Did it make you dizzy? It made me a little unsteady on my feet. Not like room was spinning dizzy, but... Um, we need a one-on-one -on -one challenge with Beck and Anna. You know that I'm all about challenging Anna to anything. True. It's tr <clears throat> true. Oh, my gosh. Blind with a coach telling you how to do it. Yeah. That'd be... Well, that's kind of like the hands, the, you know, helping hands one for sure. Did it make you dizzy? It made me um, a little uneasy on my feet, but not... Just because uh, of your depth not perception. Spin, not spinny head. Yeah. yeah. The depth perception was the, the, I think, the most difficult. Wow, there's paint everywhere. 
paint all over me. How about the husbands in a craft off? We did that. That would be so funny. Yes, we did that kind of for Valentine's Day. Yes. They were, they were in teams. I think we would need some more. Yeah. 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 Maybe one-on-one -on -one instead of two to two. That was a lot. Yeah. Gosh, it was funny, though. It was. It, it was really funny. was. I'm trying to think of the crafts that we could create. That's, I don't, I don't know. I'm trying to think. They're really concerned about you getting a headache. About me getting a headache? Yes. Guys, it's okay. I have headaches a lot. I'm, I promise I'll be fine. Velcro dartboard. <laughs> oh my gosh. Turn the tail on the donkey, like all that fun stuff. Hilarious. Yeah, yeah Hilarious. it would be really funny. What I also think, now this isn't crafting, but if you guys wanted to pick up these for your kids, I think it would be hysterical to get these for your kids along with some Nerf guns because let me tell you, if you're trying to like speed around and nail somebody with a Nerf gun, yeah. you're not gonna see no. where the crap is. That would be is. funny, yeah. So Nerf gun war with these for kids or adults, I don't know, would be really funny, I think. I think. Oh, be. hubby's with drunk goggles. Well, I'm just gonna tell on my husband and Anna's husband and tell you that um, their toleration is pretty good. So I'm not sure that, um, I'm not sure it would affect them much. James, on the other hand, doesn't really drink. No. So yeah, his, yeah. Uh, his tolerance would probably be pretty low if I had to guess. Oh, no, Grizel. I, live in, I have Meniere's disease. I live in a constant state of dizziness. I still drink. So you have to watch out for what? Sodium and all that fun stuff, too. Oh, yes. And I love sodium. I feel so I bad. Sodium. I know. I'm sorry, Grizel. I always say, which of course when you have it, you've lived with it for so long normally that like it's your normal. But if I was like allergic to gluten or peanut butter or chocolate, there's people that are allergic to chocolate. I would, I don't even know. Number one, I'd be skinny. <laughs> sure would be. Not me because I still have carbs. Carbs are life. Well, I just love food. I'm not really, I love I'm food. not really picky about it. I saw this, uh, this meme and it was this fella laying in bed with a dream bubble and it was like what normal people think about when they first wake up and it was like driving your car and going to work and, Taking like, your shower, and yeah. then it was like foodies and it was like what are we gonna have for breakfast lunch yeah. and dinner it's an addiction but I have and I have it like I have an addiction to food it's a bad one anytime we plan anything we're like but where are we eating yes my husband if I'm like hey James I need to go to Knoxville and take some stuff back to Target he's like ah you know if you want your mom to go with you you can ask. And I was like, well, I was thinking about going to eat. I'll go. He, if you throw in going through a drive-thru or going to eat anywhere, James is like, I'm in. Let's Done. go. <laughs> yes. He would go through like hours of torture, me trying on clothes, whatever, for like six hours if he knew he could get one good meal out of it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the same way. I love food. I sure do. If I were allergic to chocolate, I would just live on an EpiPen injection. <laughs> Oh. oh my gosh. April, thank you for being here. We very much enjoyed this. We sure, sure did. I mean, this wasn't that bad either. I want to see how the other girls fare at this. I almost want to see these exact three projects done three different times with me, Beck, and Anna yeah. to see how, how they do. Um, I'm the guinea pig here. I would say use one hand for the majority of it. Because as soon as I started filling stuff out, it was much, much easier to do, like if you were blind. Yeah. But if you were truly drunk, that, like Becca said, that's not going to matter. It's not going to matter. You're yeah. going to be impaired. Um, oh, make the candy cake with the goggles on. At least no sharp objects. True. That's true. Um, true. For those of you wondering, I did swipe the Milky Way out of the candy. I didn't notice. Out of the back, yeah. I took I the one notice. in the back that you had glued. It was quite interesting, me getting it out. Oh, I see. Yeah. Oh, I see the little, okay, I don't know. She's a goner. She's a goner, that's okay. But it's so beautiful. If you've already taken pictures of it, you know what- Did you, you know read all, did you read the comments? There were some what? great suggestions. On the reel oh. that I posted, some people were like, cut the top out, pull the candy bar out, and put some foam in there, or it's like, put some foam great. in yeah. there. Yeah. Beck and Anna need to do the same projects. Non-dominant one-handed. Well, that's say. not fair because Anna is ambidextrous. Is she? She is. For everything? Um, I mean, yeah. She can write with her left hand decent? Yeah. yeah. I can write with my left hand. It just doesn't look as good as my right hand. Well, but, okay, hear me out. We grew up playing sports, and you train yourself to do things both with your left and your right hand when you're playing sports. 
Come here. I mean, you. Come here. Right now? Right. Becca, right handed, and Becca, left handed. I mean, the right handed is a lot better, but I can do it. But let me see how, how your left handed is. I hate when people look at me riding and Becca doesn't, doesn't care. Well, when you have kids too, that's all they do is stare at you. Right. Well, that E's not, or B's not good. They're not the same. But they're I'm legible. Shocked. I'm shocked. No, I can't write with my right, my, with my left hand. I I can't do it. Let me try, and then we'll show you on the overhead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh no, for sure not. No, nothing will stop me getting a chocolate. Um. <laughs> when I come from school, I do not change my clothes waiting for Jose to come home or call to say, let's go out for dinner. <laughs> I love that. Jen says she's left-handed right for scissors. That is interesting. I guess because there aren't very many left-handed scissors. That's as hard as I can try. Available. Tongue out, biting lip. That's as hard as I can that's try. That's not bad. Actually, yours might look better than mine. No. No. No, my right-handed looks like worse than your left-handed. Ambidextrous, these ambidextrous people is ridiculous. What, Jan? I don't think you need to pull that out of the party. Keep that, <laughs> Keep that one to yourself. I'm kidding, <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, Beckett is right-handed, but Bat's left-handed. I'm, and we've talked about this before on lives. People need to check, especially people who play sports, need to check what their dominant eye is. Because sometimes you have to change the hand that you place a certain score depending on which eye is dominant. So I'm right-handed but left eye dominant. So like shooting a gun, I do it left-handed. Or playing pool, I do it left-handed. I'm sure if I played uh, softball, I would need to play left-handed since my left eye would be dominant, need to be forward. But anyways, um, I write right-handed but do everything else left-handed. I think it's because my dad is left-handed. Interesting. So you eat left-handed and everything? That's strange. Yeah. We should we should make a video doing everything left-handed for one day. Patty and said, I iron left-handed because my mom was left-handed and that's the way the board was set up. I love this is so fun. This so I took Charlie to the pediatrician and the amazing nurse, she's the best. Uh, we I plop him down on the the exam table and she goes, Oh, you're a lefty? And I was like, no, but the way that I put him down, the way that I carry him is the way that a left-handed person How do you would. carry him? He's always on this arm. Yeah, that's how my hand, that's how I hold my kids. Really? Yeah. All the time? Yeah. And you use? Because I can use my right hand that way. Wait, no, he's on my, that, that's what it is. It's oh. switched. He's on this arm. Oh. That's why it's weird. And, but to lay him down, his feet are this way okay. and his head is this okay. way. Yes. So I plopped it down. She was like, are you a lefty? And then the changing table, and poor James does too. That is weird. Yes. Yes. This is the arm that James puts him do on. Do you vacuum right-handed or left-handed? Right-handed. Okay. Yeah, I do too. But I do the weirdest things left-handed. Like um, now, like fixing his bottles and stuff, I'm better doing it with my left hand than my right hand because I hold him with my right hand. I don't know. I, I, it's like I feel more stable holding him with my dominant hand. Because it's stronger. So I hold him with my dominant hand. So then I have, I'm forced to do everything else with my left hand. When you carry his infant carrier, is it with your right arm or your left arm? Right. See, when I, when I would carry my kids, infant carrier was my right arm right. too. Yes. But I would carry them in my left arm. It's very weird. Okay. Yeah. How would you carry your babies? Let me know. I'll put that back. Where was his bone folder? In the back? Oh, yeah, I don't know. I'd have Maybe. to look. I'd have to look, yeah. You'll have to come over here and fix that for sure. My mom said in her days that all schools would make sure you use your right hand only. How terrible would that have been for lefties, honestly? One of my best friends growing up was a lefty, and she, sometimes she had a heart. <laughs> for sure. For sure. Well, guys, let me know how you like this. I had a ton of fun. I had to concentrate so hard, honestly. Also, I, wa I want Anna to be here. I want Anna to do this. I think it'd be funny. I also think it'd be funny if no one had put them on before. 
we just put stuff on the tables like here's your I goggles. I had no idea. Yeah. 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 Because once you put them on, you can kind of figure out uh, how it goes. But again, if you bought these, a tip with them is flip one of the lenses. Flip one of the lenses. It makes it twice as hard. Yeah. Um, for sure. This isn't too bad though. I mean, looks like a kindergartner did it. But not too bad. Not this, too bad. of course, I can just peel right off. I, I'll tell you this too. There is a video coming out this weekend about me testing Dollar Tree vinyl. And it's the most hilarious video ever. It's probably going to be like six minutes long because it's basically like, let's test it. This sucks. <laughs> Unfortunately, because a dollar and it felt really good and it cut pretty good and it weeded pretty good. And then I realized how thin and sheer you because know, you don't think about that. If you guys use a good quality vinyl like we use Starcraft, if you were to put that Dollar Tree vinyl, let's say you put white vinyl on a black canvas, if that white vinyl is going to turn muddy, it's going to look gray because it's so sheer. You can see right through it, which is so odd, something you don't think about. So. And there's also no such thing as permanent vinyl. Becca, did you know that Dollar Tree vinyl is, is marketed as permanent? That thin see-through stuff? Interesting. It, honestly, honestly, it is one of the least stickiest materials I've ever even worked with. Well, I think tape is more sticky than I think the scotch vinyl. tape yeah. is more sticky than this yeah. Dollar Tree vinyl. I'm not even kidding. But it'll be, it'll be a fun one for you to see if you're wanting to see a little bit, a little test on that for sure. Uh, please like the video. Heather, yes. Everyone like the video for sure. If you have any questions about oak and lamb, let us know. Again, this was not one of the videos that we do often um, at all because this was p basically for entertainment purposes. You're not going to learn a ton from this except maybe to get those goggles if you want to have a good time with them. <laughs> but we usually do a lot of free education over here. But the education we give you here is not even close to the education and the amount of support we give you in Oak and Lamb in that amazing flock membership. Again, the cut files, the member only videos, the other amazing perks that we're working on now and that we continue to give you all the time. Hundreds of cut files, that Facebook group is priceless, amazing. So let me know if you have any questions about the membership, we would love for you to join. Now is the best time, sure is. Honestly, it isn't much less than StarCraft Vinyl either. Jenny, you're not wrong. I mean, StarCraft Vinyl is very affordable. It it's is. shocking how affordable it's it is. It's 65 cents for a 12 by 12 sheet. So two of those is a dollar. Dollar 30, yeah. Dollar 30. Mm -hmm. I was gonna say, I'm about to think about it. It's a dollar 30. Two sheets is a dollar 30. And that's a dollar 25 for two sheets, for two sheets, but it's 48 inches. So if you cut that, you know. Um, you have, you have to do your math whenever you do that. And you got to think, if I'm buying that, which is, what, four feet, four feet long? But the quality, the quality is so much less than StarCraft. It's like the, the extra couple bucks you'd spend on StarCraft is so well worth it. Don't even, don't even buy it, for sure. StarCraft is amazing. Megan said, I think we've learned that not only should you not drink and drive, but maybe you shouldn't drink and craft either. This is education to me. Megan, that's a good point. That's a good point. For sure, I agree. <laughs> I agree. I do like the left-handed, the left-handed thing. Let me know if you guys want to see that too. Also, I'd be I willing think, to do that. I think straight up blindfolded would be funny. Just straight up blindfolded, uh, not even helping anybody. Just seeing, seeing what's going on. Uh, everybody just watching the poor person blindfolded. Anywho, we have. Organic content going out tomorrow and Saturday, and then we'll be live. Actually, we already have, Rachel's already scheduled our live events for next week. Oh, yes. sad news, friends, sad news. Um, did we did we even tell them that we were going to do the direct-to-garment powder for 100% cotton sublimation and all that stuff? I think it's on the schedule already, mm -hmm. isn't it? Mm -hmm. We got it in yesterday, tested it out, and I don't love it like I thought I would. So we're going to test out a couple other things. We may end up pushing that out another week. It depends. We've ordered a couple other things. but um, So if you see some changes, yeah, don't panic. It's yeah. because something hasn't come in from the, um, from the mail yet. We're waiting on some things for that. But we have like two, two weeks of 
uh, YouTube live scheduled out for you guys to be able to see and enjoy. And we're constantly finding new things to be able to craft with you. We honestly probably have 30 ideas bouncing around that we're trying to decide if they need to be member only, if they're that amazing, or if they could be lives, or if they could be a pre-recorded video. So there's a lot to juggle. Uh, definitely check back always on the YouTube channel homepage to see what lives are coming up. If you're not subscribed, make sure you do subscribe and ring the bell and turn notifications on so that when we do go live, if we switch a time or if you forget about something, it'll send you that notification so that you know when we are live, you can be live with us. What time are you pushing those videos out tomorrow and Saturday? Uh, 4 p.m. 4. Okay. 4 p.m. Yes, absolutely. I don't know what powder and supplies did you order. I'm wondering if I ordered the same. I don't remember the, where's the bag? I don't know where it is. Oh, um, in goodies, DTF transfer adhesive is the powder. And then I can't remember what the brand of the sheets are, but I think it's the sheets. I don't think it's the powder. I think the sheets that I got are maybe the issue. So that's we what we're tests. testing out. We're doing and some tests. whenever you guys can be patient for the video, we're keeping all of our tests to be yeah. able to share with you do's and don'ts as well. Yeah, so what went wrong, helpful. what didn't. Yes. Although I have noticed, and I told Rachel, I've watched some videos. I did watch Mr. Crafty Pants. That's the one that I've, I've seen the most. And then he referenced a TikToker. So I watched some of her stuff. The ones that I've seen come out sort of looking distressed, even if they're not supposed to. So that was disappointing to me. Yeah, especially if you're looking for a more professional yeah, look. Yeah, it's disappointing to me. So again, just because something is doable doesn't mean you should do it. do it. Yeah. Like there's a difference in doable and it looking really nice. So I don't know. Maybe we'll, I, I don't know. We'll see. Either way, even if we don't love the video, we'll probably do or love the product and love the outcome. We'll probably do a member only so that you guys can see what it looks like, see what we've experienced. Yeah. Um, and I mean, Obviously, we want to test stuff out for you and give you our honest opinion. So that's what we're going to do. Always. Always, always. Did you give away the UV light kits yet? Did I miss it, Stacey? We gave them away yesterday, the, like the very first few minutes of the live. So if you're wondering which winners, um, go check out that video for sure. First couple minutes. Okay, guys, if you don't have any questions about Oak and Lamb, you don't have any questions for me, um, the drunk goggles are linked down below. So is most of the supplies that we use today. Uh, thanks for crafting with us. This was super, super fun. Again, if you want to see more of what we do, if you want us to continue to be able to do this, the best way to do that is to buy a membership if you haven't already. Keeps the lights on, keeps me and Becca going. So make sure you do grab that membership today if you haven't already. Let us know. You also are more than welcome to email us hello at oakenlam.com if you have any questions, if you need us to help push you off of that fence and better explain any perks that we have for you guys. We will see you Tuesday, but before then, you will see us this coming weekend, tomorrow and Saturday uh, at 4 p.m. Eastern. We're testing out some new times, seeing about that. I know everybody uh, sometimes gets off of work a little bit later and things like that, so we're going to test out some times and see how, how it goes. Thank you guys so much. Have a safe weekend. Uh, what did you say tomorrow is? Tomorrow, oh, let me check. Oh. I made the thumbnail for it and I can't even remember. Me either. Well, it, it was from... Well, it was going to go out and then we pushed it. Yeah. Yeah. Let me see here. Oh, it's a Cricut beginner hack. So if you are a Cricut newbie or if you know a Cricut newbie, send it to them. If mm. you're not, this might be a really good refresher. Or if you think that you're a seasoned Cricuter, maybe it'll teach you something you don't already know. So that'll be a good video tomorrow. Um... It's 10 minutes, not too long, which is good. Also, let me know how you guys are liking the times for our organic Pre -recorded. versus live. Yeah. yeah. Do you like them shorter like we've been doing? Short, sweet, to the point. Are our lives too long for you? Would you rather our lives be shorter? Would you rather our lives be longer? Lord knows sometimes they are long. There was a stretch of like two weeks where they were legit. An hour and 18 minutes. An hour, one hour and 18 minutes exactly, like four in a row from me. And Becca's like, do you have like a superpower or something? Too much. But... Let me know what you guys want to see. We're always here to make sure that you all are happy and getting the content that you want. So leave us some comments down below. Thank you guys so much. We will see you Tuesday.